This is the situation tonight here at the Port Authority. Things have calmed down considerably and are much less hectic. However, it has been a tumultuous 24 hours for many Greyhound customers who found themselves stranded here, waiting and waiting. Tired, hungry, thirsty, no money. Anger, frustration, and confusion inside the Greyhound bus terminal at the Port Authority. How long have you been waiting for a bus? Since 9.30 last night. Greyhound customers sleeping on benches, some of them with children, after waiting for hours on long lines for their buses from as far back as Sunday night. 6.40 yesterday. Patricia Shipley is at her wit's end. She's trying to get to Atlanta and says the wait is maddening. They said they had no drivers, so we, they rescheduled us to go on a bus at 10.30 tonight. A number of passengers here say that's the excuse Greyhound gave them for the delays. They had no drivers to drive the buses. Why no drivers now? Suddenly? We went to the Greyhound customer service office this morning to find out what was going on. Can anybody tell us what's going on with the bus delays? Passengers are saying there are no drivers. We did not get an answer. Employees left the room when they saw our camera. Later in the day, Greyhound conceded in a statement, we are currently experiencing delays at the Port Authority as we wait for drivers to become available once they complete their federally mandated rest. We wanted to know why this kind of scheduling problem could not have been prevented or planned for in advance. Greyhound would not go on camera to answer questions, but blames a sudden increase in ridership. The union believes it was an equipment and manpower issue. This is Greyhound said it hoped to have all passengers on their way to their destination soon. For fed up customers who've been waiting it out here, it couldn't happen soon enough. My two day trip turned into a three day trip now. Tonight, Greyhound says most of the stranded passengers are indeed on their way home, but a few are still here and won't be leaving till later tonight, as in 1030 later tonight. At the Port Authority on the west side, Scott Rappaport, CBS 2 News.